One way that I glory in his name is by sharing the atonement of Jesus Christ with others. And that's kind of a lot, but just sharing the message of Jesus Christ with others because life is really, really hard. But it's so incredible to see that when someone learns about Jesus Christ and um, that he suffered for all of our pains and our afflictions and everything that we go through and that we can turn to him in our hard times and that he can help us, it's so incredible just to see their change in their outlook on life and how it just becomes different. And so that was one way that I gloried in his name is by sharing this message as often as I could, whether if it was through sending someone a scripture or doing phone calls or talking to people in person, any way that we can, I guess, share about Jesus Christ and what he did for us was one way that I glorified in his name. I know that this book is true. I know with all my heart. And I know that it's true because, because I feel so much joy as I read it. And I can definitely tell a difference in my life when I don't read it, when I don't read it consistently. And I have a strong testimony of this book and the power that it can have in changing people's lives. Because I've seen it as people actually read the Book of Mormon and actually try to put that effort in, that they, that they are able to see that the love that God has for them. And this book testifies of Jesus Christ, and that's why it's so powerful. That's why it has the spirit it does. Because it's another testament of Jesus Christ, just like it says on the front. And it's a truly incredible and powerful book. And echoing the words of Joseph Smith, that any man will go closer to God by abiding by his precepts. And I, I'm so grateful for it, and that God loves us enough to give us this book. And I say these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I am so grateful for this opportunity to share my testimony about the Book of Mormon because I love the Book of Mormon. I know without a doubt this book is the Word of God. I know that it contains the fullness of the everlasting gospel and that it tells us exactly what we need to do in order to return to our Heavenly Father who loves us so much. I have always had a testimony of the Book of Mormon, but especially as I have read and not only read, but also studied it and really applied the principles that it contains to my own life, especially as a missionary, I have seen the, the ways that it can change our life and the happiness and the joy that it brings in times of distress and turmoil, which is a lot of what our world is going through. So I know that as we read it and study it, we will, like the introduction says, draw closer to God than by abiding to any other precepts. Um, I know that this book was written for our day specifically, and that the prophets in this book were prophets of God who were leading and directing the same church. And I am so grateful for the knowledge that we have of it and the power that it contains. And I say that in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. testimony of the Book of Mormon. I love the Book of Mormon. I love, ever since I was little, I've loved the great examples in the Book of Mormon and the fun stories, but most importantly, I've loved that it testifies of my Savior, Jesus Christ. I know that God gave us the Book of Mormon in order to bless our lives and to give us the fullness of the gospel. I know that the Book of Mormon is a testament of Jesus Christ, and reading it will bring us closer to him. What I am more imagining, what are thou more imagining, should gentle the Hello, my name is Elder Johnston. I'm serving in Toronto, Canada, and I'm so grateful for the Book of Mormon and its role in my life. I know it's the Word of God. I know that reading it and following the counsel held inside will bring more joy and peace to your life than anything else in this world. Um, but maybe most importantly for me is the Book of Mormon really shows to me the love of God for His children. Um, I know that God loves all of us, and that's why He gave us this book, to lead us and to guide us. And I know that by reading it, um, we'll come closer to Him and we'll feel of His love for us. I say these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.